The Molly Malone statue commemorates the More volume, more volume. More volume. The Molly Malone statue commemorates a fictitious Dublin fishmonger, better known to Dubliners as the Tart with the Cart. Uh, it was designed by Gian uh, uh, Reinhardt and was erected in 1988 and unveiled by the then Lord Mayor Ben Briscoe. Uh, it was part of the Dublin Millennium celebrations. Frank Hart, who is an expert on Dublin street politics, famously said, never judge a song by the company it keeps. I think he was talking about this. Uh, 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 the song was composed, this song was composed by James Yorkson of Edinburgh, although it was published originally in Cambridge, Massachusetts, and by Francis Brothers and Day in London in 1884. Uh, the, the London edition was reprinted by permission of Kohler and Sons of Edinburgh, implying that a first edition was published in Scotland, though no copies of that have ever been located. So here we have the Dublin anthem written by a Scotsman. So, yep. right. Frank, Frank Hart's Frank. granddaughter. Frank. Fra Frank Hart's granddaughter. Um, uh, sorry, Siobhan Hart is going to sing Molly, and you've all to join in the chorus. <laughs> Brendan Kennedy up there, he's, he's going to uh, sing, he's going to issue a new broadsheet of a new ballad he has just written. So come along here, we, we hope we can find him. Yeah, Sandro. 